This video has been produced for the benefit of all skiers who are striving to improve. It describes the typical stages of learning edge control skills. The skier in this presentation is not a professional. She is a student and latecomer to the sport with a passion for learning. Many skiers' first attempts at parallel turns contain a big throw of the ski tail sideways at the start of the turn. This tail tossing move is called a pivot. Many skiers never progress past this stage of learning. Deep inside your mind All alone I have cried Silent tears In this slow-mo, notice how Janice is throwing the tails of her ski sideways at the beginning of her turns. This is called a pivot. It's a lower skill level way to turn the skis. Often a skier will remove the pivot at the beginning of the turn, but will twist the feet more than needed through the rest of the turn. We call this Y-Track Steering. Steering is the act of twisting the legs and feet to produce a turn and is a foundation edge control skill. Y-Track Steering results from over twisting the legs and feet and leaves behind a very wide skid track on the snow. It is typical of lesser skilled skiers who look for constant speed control. Notice the Y-Track Steering in this slow-mo. The skis get very sideways in relation to the actual direction Janice is moving. Because of this, the skis are constantly braking and keeping her speed down. Here the pivot is gone and Janice has refined her steering to a more narrow track version, but the end of her turn still contains the hard edge set and up move she previously used when pivoting her skis. Removing them will be the next step as they represent wasted energy and movement. In this slow-mo, notice how Janice's skis remain pointing more in the direction she's traveling. This is narrow track steering and is a higher skill level form of steering. Also notice the hard edge set and snow flying just prior to her aggressive end of the turn up move. Here Janice keeps her narrow track steering while softening the hard edge set at the end of the turn. In this slow-mo, notice a smoother turn finish and lesser amounts of snow flying off of Janice's skis. This is the result of softening the hard edge set at the end of the turn. Also notice the exaggerated up move still remains. Here Janice sheds the unneeded up move and has arrived at a high level version of the steered turn. Notice the smoothness and fluidity this type of steered turn allows. Finally, she refines her high-level steered turns even further, displaying an impressive degree of effortless efficiency in her steered turns. As a last step in her learning progression, she leaves steering behind and moves up to carving. In carving, she simply tips her skis on edge and lets a bent ski produce the turns for her. No twisting of the legs and feet is needed when carving. The skis do all the turning work for the skier. Notice how cleanly Janice tips her skis out of one turn and into the next, then moves her weight forward to start the new turn. This has been a YourSkiCoach.com production. Best of luck to each of you in your learning journey.